So in today's training video, we're going to talk about the text hyperlink, something that's a basic of internet marketing, but I've had this question come up so many times over the past couple of days that I felt it warranted doing a blog post on it. Hey guys, my name is Chef Katrina and we are going to dive into creating a hypertext link. So let's get right into this. Right now you guys are seeing the back office of a blog that I'm currently writing and actually it's on the hiding uh, the ugly URL with a text hyperlink. So exactly what I'm talking about right now in this video is actually the blog post that I'm creating for you. So. I want you to understand that all of us go through this. This is a process we're all learning. Not all of us come into the internet marketing world or the online world and know all the lingo. It, it's really hard to to learn it. It's, it's definitely uh, not something that comes naturally. It's like learning a foreign language. So I totally get that. And in this blog post, you'll see that I talk about it like, we're, you know, what are widgets, hyperlinks, themes, plugins, sidebars, above the fold. I mean, there's so much terminology that it can get extremely overwhelming, right? So the simple thing I want to start out with is what we call a text hyperlink. And really what this does is that inside of here, you'll see I, I've created this content uh, where we talk about like, hey, could you imagine reading a blog post where the author is talking about blankety blank and then they have this really long URL that they want you to click on and uh, you're like, it just interrupts the flow. Like you can kind of see it, it just kind of doesn't seem natural, right? So the one thing you can do and work around this is what we call a text link. So maybe you're talking about a certain product or service. Uh, maybe you're talking about, you know, how do you get started with this? So what I would do, and I've actually got this right here. I'm gonna go ahead and delete this real quick. So it's like, if I were to say, hey, you know, um, check out, this amazing blogging course, right? And so I just, I, I just want to make it feel natural. Like I don't want to feel like I'm selling something separate. So this amazing blogging course is something maybe I would highlight. And then right up here, there's this insert or edit the link. And all you would do is put the URL that you're looking for. So typically I would start with the HTTP um, on there and then whatever you want them to go to, um, in that link. So whether you're linking back to an article inside your blog or you want to take them to something you're an affiliate for, um, that is exactly what you're doing right here. So I'm just going to go put in this uh, my affiliate link for blogging ingredients. Um, yes, I would like it to open in a new window. So I don't want them to replace my blog that they're currently reading because maybe they're in the middle of content. They're clicking on it and I want it to open up in a new window so they don't lose my blogging site. So I'm going to say it's open up in a new window and then really all I'm going to do is just hit the return button. And as you can see, it's basically highlighted this now and it's put the hyperlink in there. So that's a real easy way to create a natural looking content, right? So not only am I sharing uh, maybe some information or a book or a product or service, but now it just seems like a flows organically in the post. It doesn't seem like it's all outright sharing or promoting. So this is a great way for you to kind of hide affiliate links, um, put in some text links on here. This is also good for SEO when you're using it with your keywords. So there's some real strengths to using the text hyperlink. So I absolutely recommend it. It's as simple as that. So just highlighting it, using this. And if you want to like, remove the link, you just click on this right here, highlight it, and then remove the link. So quick, easy, simple way of creating a text hyperlink. I hope this helps you and uh, good luck in your blogging. If you have any further questions, comment down below. Let me know if there's anything else you're struggling with, with, with on your blog. I'd love to do some training on it for you to help make sure that you stay on course with your blogging and stay on course with your marketing. So thanks guys for joining me. Again, my name is Chef Katrina and you are here at thechefkatrina.com. So just leave your comment down below and we'll see you guys in the next training video.